Hello and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to open lots of thrift mail. So if you like this kind of content, I would love it if you'd subscribe to my channel where I upload thrifting, decor, and DIY videos. And of course, you can always find me on Instagram at Nicole North Garden. Here we go. <music> Good to see you. It is Thursday evening and I have gotten really behind on opening packages because I know you all like to see them get opened, but with having no voice, I've gotten completely backlogged on my videos. I am uh, trying to get back, but um, I thought, you know what? It's, it's, it's late. It's almost 10 almost 10 o'clock on Thursday night, but I had a free moment. Um, my hubby is ill. He's sick. He has the cold um, that has been going around. So he's asleep already and my kids are doing homework and I thought I'm just going to take this time and just open these presents, uh, packages, thrift mail, whatever you want to call them. They feel like presents. So I always think of them as presents. I'm going to go ahead and open them. And, um, this way I can get this video posted hopefully tomorrow, Friday. Um, just going to stay up late and edit it. I'm not going to do a ton of editing. Um, and hopefully that'll be good. Okay. I do want to show you one thing though. Very uncharacteristic of me. I bought something for my house off of Amazon. <sighs> Look at these. Aren't they gorgeous? They're fake. And I have purchased these tulips before. I have them in white. I bought them like two years ago and they've stood the test of time. Um, but I saw on someone's Instagram that they had this really cool, not this particular basket, but a really cool flat backed basket um, from Target, which is now sold out. And I was like, I said, I was talking to Jamie from Border Bananas. I was like, I want that basket, but we couldn't find it anywhere online. So I found these on Am this. It was a set. It's a set of two baskets on Amazon. And then I bought the tulips and I did spend some money on these, but they're so beautiful. And you know, spring is not going to arrive here in Minnesota till like May. Like we don't really get flowers going. You might get some crocuses like end of April if it's warm in April, but really our spring doesn't really get going till like Mother's Day. It's really late. And I'm a flower girl, a flower lover. So these are going to, I told my hubby, I'm like, I'm making spring. I don't care that there's feet of snow outside still. I'm making my house springy, which I do every year. So I just wanted to share those with you. Um, I'll try, if I remember, I will put the links down below. I am not an Amazon affiliate. I don't get anything. Um, but I just think, you know, if you're looking for some really good faux flowers, um, those are good ones to get. All right. So let's go ahead and get into the thrift mail. I'm going to open the oldest one first. And I'm so sorry that I haven't opened them. And it's not that I don't care about them. It's just that I didn't have a voice when I picked these up. And then I just haven't gotten around to it. So this one comes to me from, I'm not going to give names because there's just a letter, but this one's coming from Rhode Island. I'm going to pause the camera to open it and like to get the paper wrapping off and then I'll come back on this way. It's easier to edit that way. So let me pause. Okay. I got the package open. Oh my goodness. I'm seeing a lot of Christmas here, friends. I need to, I need to find a place to set it down. I'm in, a, I'm on the floor of my craft room, but what you're not seeing is the chaos around me because, you know, I came back from my mom's crafting weekend and I basically brought like my crafting closet with me. So I need to put things away. So, okay. So let's see. <gasps> oh, these are so cute. Look at these. I'm guessing, did she make these? These are so adorable. There's several and I can totally make a garland out of these. They are so cute. Oh my goodness. Adorable. Oh, oh my God. Holy cow, these are adorable. Oh my goodness. An angel and a Santa. So cute. I think this whole, oh my gosh. There's really good stuff in this box. Okay. Oh, oh awesome. Look at that, that's gorgeous. Oh my goodness, I love that. I don't have any multicolor bottle brush trees. I look at them all the time, but I don't own any. So this is absolutely stunning. Love it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, it just keeps coming. 
coming. Holy cow. Okay, you all know, um, for those of you who have been with me for any length of time, I adore vintage Christmas. Like, it's probably my favorite thing to collect. Oh my goodness, look at him. Isn't that adorable? Oh, this is wonderful. <gasps> and there's a little mini one. Oh my gosh, so cute. Oh my goodness, I love him. Oh, this is, oh my gosh, he's on snowshoes. That is so cool. And it looks like he was maybe either a bank, I guess he could be a bank or a light. I have something else. It's not this one, but it's similar in that it could be, a. it was made either as a bank or a lamp. So cool. And this is, what does it say? I can't read it. It says something on the bottom, but I don't know what, I can't read it. Okay, and here's a matcher. There's a matcher for the tree. So now I have two of them. Those are gorgeous. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Rhode Island friend, you outdid yourself with this box. Oh, oh my gosh. Holy cow. I love all of these things. Oh, there's another one. He's on skis. Oh my gosh. Oh, these are amazing. Guys, these, oh, and there's another one. It's a pull toy. Look how jolly he is. Oh my goodness. He is so cute. They, look at the three, look how they look together. These are so wonderful. Oh my gosh. I might have to make this my thumbnail. So cute. Holy cow, those are adorable. There's another little guy. What's inside him? I don't know. So cute. <gasps> okay, here's another little angel. This goes with those ones that I open. Let me put her with her friends. Make sure they all stay together. Okay. Oh, this is so cute. Did you make this too? I love this. So it's a little box and it says on one side, believe, and on the other, it's got a Santa, but look it. Now, I don't know if this is how you intended it, but you could totally, whoops, that's upside down, use these on tiered trays just like this. So you get like a two for one. Remember, we've talked about that before with the tops and bottoms of boxes and tins. Love that. Ah, oh, got some, oh, wow, these are cool. Are these old beads? I don't have any. Oh my goodness, I do not have any of these. Now, Tarnished Treasures has these. And again, she has the coolest stuff and I never see a lot of the things that she has. There's the old kind of beads. Oh my gosh, these are amazing. Holy cow. There's stockings, just to keep me warm. They're so cool. Oh my gosh. These are, oh my gosh, they're like antique. These are so cool. The guys, these are real old stockings. Look at that. The, the toe is darned. Oh my gosh, these are amazing. I'm going to hang these up at Christmas time because they're so cute. Holy cow. That's adorable. Can you see them? So cute. Uh, oh. Amazing. Wow. These are amazing. No, there's no card. Oh, is there? There is a card. Did I miss it? Yes. Okay, I cannot show this. It has addresses on it. She says, I hope you enjoy this. I displayed it for many years at Christmas. Okay, and it's postmarked 1987. And it was sent to her from Colorado. Okay. Let's see what it is. Oh my gosh, it's so delicate. Okay, I'll read the instructions on how to fan it out properly. Because it says if it gets like smushed for a while, then that just means the fold has set too strongly. But the idea is that it will look like that. That is so cool. <gasps> what a treasure, holy cow. Oh, and it's signed by the artist. 
which is that person, J. Myers, 1987. And that was all before crickets, people. This is amazing. Gosh, how did she do that? Look at the, the intricate cuts. That's amazing. Well, I will display it with care. It's called the Dickens tree based on the only description of a Christmas tree that Dickens ever wrote from a magazine article. Cool. And there's a whole story. Um, I'll have to read all about it. Hand cut, hand cut paper trees. No crickets involved. Amazing. Thank you so much. I will definitely display this and very carefully. I will take good care of it. That is amazing. Okay. Wow. If you could see the wonder that is in front of me with all of this vintage Christmas, you'd be amazed too. Okay. All right. We've got a little napkin, it looks like. So cute. It's adorable. That'll be great on a shelf. And one more. Oh, no. Two more items. Let's see. One more wrap. Oh, it's a little baby. Oh my gosh, it's a whole set. These are so cute. Oh my word, these are just darling. Oh wait, I missed something. Look at that. There's so many treasures. Oh, felt stockings. These are so cute. See, and you can put these on a garland, like a twine, and have a little garland of that too. Those would be very cute. Put them with that. Oh, and a Santa flag. Is this a flag? Or is this a... Nope, it's not a flag. Oh, it's like a, a cloth, a dishcloth, something. It's really cute. And it says, Jolly, round, and kind is he. Santa, you bring joy to me. Well, isn't that the truth? I agree with that statement. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's one more vintage linen looking item. Oh, this is pretty. Like a, a, a napkin or something? It's really pretty. I will definitely use this on one of my shelves. Gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, well, that was a treasure trove. Thank you so much, Rhode Island friend. Those are amazing. I cannot even believe you parted with all of those items. And I'm definitely not seeing a card, so I don't think I'm missing anything. My mom always told me to open the card first, but so I always, oh, wait. I missed it. Mom would not be pleased. <laughs> I found the card. It somehow got lost, but I have found it. Okay. Oh, that's gorgeous. All right. Here's your package. Some of the stuff is old, new, and in between the plastic. Oh, now, here's our explanations. Okay. The plastic Santas are from the 1940s and 50s. I do not know how old the Santas in the sleighs are. I hope you'll find something to you. Something to my liking? Oh my gosh, the whole box was a treasure trove. P.S. I loved your DIY chalkboard wood slices. Well, thank you very much. Well, this was amazing. Oh my goodness. So, um, I, I just can't even. I can't even. I love everything and I cannot pick a favorite. Um, I, I can't pick a favorite. Here we go. We're moving on to the next package. This one comes to me from Wisconsin, a near neighbor. Look at that. Okay, I have the box open. Oh my goodness, I'm seeing bonnets. Oh, oh no way. I have never seen these. Oh my gosh. These are so cute. And that is so true. The time to be happy is now. Oh my gosh. Um, It might be coming off a little um, like orangey, but it's actually very bright pink just like this is this is coming off orange just because the lighting is a little yellow in here I think oh, I love this so much and I will tell you that um, we used Christmas ones at Christmas time and we loved them so and now they're all packed away and I was like well what do we use now so <laughs> these are darling oh they're different they're all different oh my goodness okay oh my gosh these are so cute special friends give the heart a lift that's what this one says Gosh, now that is like the original Holly Hobby dress. I've never seen these before. I've only ever seen Christmas Holly Hobby glasses. Fun is doubled when you share. Oh, look at 
that one. Isn't that so cute for summertime? Oh my gosh. Maybe I'm going to want to like display something with some of these. I don't, maybe I don't want to use them all. What if my children break them? I'll think on it. Life's a picnic. Enjoy it. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love these. Thank you so much, friend from Wisconsin. These are absolutely darling. Okay. All right. Again, I'm going to open the next package. This one's coming from Dee at Thrill of the Thrift. She spoils me so much. And I have a package for her. <laughs> I'm so bad at getting things shipped out. But I'm going to be shipping something to Tammy soon. Maybe I'll just get myself my act together and send that out too um, this week. I'm so, I think I'm supposed to ship that on, is it Tuesday or Monday, Tammy? I don't remember. Anyway, so maybe I'll get D's packed up and send that to her too because I've been putting things together to send to her and then I'm, I'm just so bad at sending things out. My friend, um, well, you know who you are. Um, I'm just bad at sending things out. Like I had, I had a tin for someone and I had it for a really long time and just, I don't know why. I just, I don't know why I just get things and then I forget to send them. I, it's not even forgetting. I like, I don't know. I don't know. I have no good excuse. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm seeing luster wear. I might have to pause the camera again because she is like a really good wrapper. These are very well wrapped. So I might need a moment to unwrap things. Hold on. Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. This is not like anything in my luster wear collection. It's got a parrot on it. Isn't that beautiful? And it says made in Japan. Gorgeous. I love that. Thank you, Dee. I don't have anything that looks like that. What is this? It's big. She totally spoils me. Okay. <gasps> no. What? It's pink milk glass. Oh my God. See, I can't believe you gave me pink milk glass. This is only the second piece I've ever seen live. Vintage Carriage House is the first channel I ever saw it on. Um, and then I found a piece for myself, and which I own, and I've never seen another piece. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. I'm sorry it's wrapped so well. I mean, I'm glad it's wrapped so well. Hold on, hold on. Let me get it out. Oh my gosh. It's a stunner. Holy cow, it's so beautiful. I guess it's like a raised, like compote or candy dish. Oh my gosh but I could totally use this in my decor. It's, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Oh, I love it. I was just thinking today, cause I posted a picture on Instagram and the shelf just above where I posted has my pink milk glass on it, which I love cause I have like greens and browns and whites and then some hints of pink for the winter decor. And I was like, oh, it'd be so nice to have another piece. Ah, look at that. Oh my gosh, Dee, I can't believe you gave that to me. <gasps> That was a really, really generous gift. Whoa, throwing things. Oh, ooh, it's a set. Look at that. Look how beautiful these are together. Oh my gosh, gorgeous. I love them. This is the last item. This is really heavy, B. All right, oh, no way. These are so pretty. Okay, these say Strawberry Garden, original design by Sultra, 1976, Japan. Oh my gosh. And I think there's, is there three or four? Holy cow, these are beautiful. Oh, there's two of these. Okay. And then there's something else. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous, gorgeous. I love those. Okay, there's one other thing. <gasps> This is beautiful. Christmas 1980. So cute. And I don't know if the colors are coming across well on camera, but this is, it's almost like more like uh, burgundies and pinks than red. It's gorgeous. Beautiful. It'll be beautiful. I'll probably put it in this room um, at Christmas time. Really pretty. Really pretty. D, thank you. You definitely spoil me. Thank you so much. Thank you, really. 
Okay, I'm gonna open the next one and then I'll come back. Okay, this one comes to me from, where? Ah, another friend from Rhode Island, Rhode Island. Funny, huh. look at that. Oh, these really are like presents. Look how fun that is. The ribbon and everything. You guys, you are so kind to me. So sweet. All right, what have we got? Huh, what's this? What is this? What is it? I don't know what this is. It's cool looking. Is it an old toy? Is it like an old baby toy? I can't think. Is it something for the kitchen? I don't know. I'll probably put it out in my kitchen, in my decor. I do not know what it is. It, it has a sound, but it doesn't open. I don't think. Not that I don't want to break it, but. All right. Let me know what this is. It's cool looking. I just don't know what it is. And I want to be able to appreciate it properly. Oh my goodness. Wait. Oh, <laughs> June. This is from my friend June. I didn't even see the name. Oh my goodness. June, tell me what this is. I don't know. I love it. I love the colors, but I don't know what it is. So you have to let me know. And she sent me a Valentine. Oh, it says it. The package wrapped. As, wait, it's okay. Happy Valentine's Day. The package wrapped as a firecracker. Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> that is so funny. <laughs> June, you cracked me up. Okay, good. I'm glad because I was like, I, am I missing something? I don't know. It looks very cool. And I'll probably set it on a tray somewhere. My guess. Okay. My, the guess I'm going to put out there is it's an old toy. I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know. I'll ask my kids. They are very creative. Maybe they'll be able to. You are so funny. That that, <laughs> that's amazing. Ah, that cracked me up. Okay. June. June. June is very kind to me as well. She has sent me other packages. We are friends um, on Instagram. I would love to be friends um, in, in real life. I mean, you know, I'd love to meet in real life at some point. I think that'd be so fun. Okay. I hate to, her wrapping is so lovely. I hate to um, mess it up. I actually have a, <laughs> I have a present for June also. <laughs> it's um, an, a food chopper that she wanted to buy for me, but I don't feel that it's in good enough condition to sell. I, so I was like, I'll just send it to you. But of course, I haven't done it yet. So now, now I have a fire lit under myself to like just get the stuff. I have to wrap something up for Etsy anyway. So I'll just wrap it all up. Oh, she told me she was sending me these. <gasps> oh my gosh. So they're not vintage. They're Pioneer Woman, but they are jadeite plates. What? Oh my goodness. These are gorgeous. June, I love them. I love them. Oh my gosh. Stunner. Look at how pretty these are. Oh my gosh. These are beautiful. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. I love them. Okay, I have the box open. This one is coming from Springfield, Missouri. <gasps> Ooh, what? <gasps> these are... Oh no, one got broken. Oh darn. But the rest are gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Stunning. Look how pretty these are. Oh, I love them. So there were four. Three made it. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. I will put those into my ornament box where they will be safe. <gasps> what is this? I love old books. Here and near. Oh my gosh. Look at how cute this is. Okay, friends. Summer decor. Patriotic decor, red, white, and blue. Oh my gosh, that is gonna be so cute. Holy cow. Okay, let's see if we can find a year. El Paso Public Library, El Paso, Texas. Crazy. And 1957. I can show you the, oh my gosh, look how cute that is. 
Well, now that's a dilemma because the cover is so cute, but then the insides are so cute too. I don't want to display it all, you know? Oh my gosh. These. Just darling. Oh, and I was going to show you the 1957 page. So cute. That is adorable. Ooh, ephemera. <clears throat> Beautiful. We've got some cards. Guessing they're for Christmas time. Ah, oh, it's St. Luke painting the Virgin and Child. Cool. Very cool. These are beautiful cards. <gasps> what? Oh my goodness gracious. This is so sweet. <laughs> Holy cow, that's cute. That's real cute. Love it. Oh dear. Oh my gosh, she's cute. Oh my gosh. Adorable. Blue, blue Bonnet Sue. Is that like um, Blue Bonnet, the, is it butter? It's butter or something, right? Dairy? So cute. She's adorable and she will definitely be in here with my other rag dolls. This is o O's Kitchen Incredible and Edible. Oh my goodness, these are cool. They're like faux chocolates. Those will be great for crafting. I'm thinking of Valentine craft. Oh my, those are really cute. Or I could just keep them as they are and put them on um, a dis like a tray for Valentine's Day, like something like this. Look at how cute these look. You'd have to raise them up a little, but of course someone might try to eat them. They look so good. Really cute. Adorable. He is cute. The soap pumper. That is so cute. Adorable little Santa. I do not have one of those. That is so cute. All right. <gasps> He's adorable. See the little vintagey looking Santa? Very cute. Oh my gosh. He's going to look so cute. I'm actually going to put him in the box with the other vintage Santas. They all get packed together. Oh, pretty. So good for crafting. Awesome. I blew through a lot of my supplies on my mom's crafting weekend, so it's good to get, get resupplied. Oh, these are cute. I don't have a lot of copper. These are great. I don't have any of these. Maybe one of them, but so cute. Oh, I love this one. You know, I love angels. Oh, these are going to be adorable. Oh my goodness, so cute. Ooh, and a Halloween one. She's fun. Thinking in the center of a Halloween wreath. I mean, I could cut it, use it to cut cookies also, but when they're this cute, I like to dis I like to use them to decorate with. Oh, and there's a whole other bag of other ones. Oh, that's different. I don't have that one. That is really cute. These are great. Ooh, that is beautiful. It's a pillowcase. I can use that in this room. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Love it. Love all of these. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm going to open the next package and I will come back on. Okay, I have them both open. And they're, I'm opening the one that says one of two. All right, I don't see a card, but I do see a card on the top of the two of two. And she says, please repair, resell, redonate, reimagine or enjoy. Okay, sounds wonderful. I've got glitter in my hair, friends. I'm sparkling for you, okay. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Holy cow. Holy cow. This might be the cutest thing I've ever seen. Look how cute he is. It's Hallmark cards. Someone laminated it. I bet a teacher did that. Teachers are smart like that, right? He's adorable. These are so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. This one's, they're not all Thanksgiving. This one is, um, Betty, is that like Betsy Ross? Is this 4th of July, you think? 
I'm going to keep that one separate. These are so cute. Oh, this is definitely, these are definitely patriotic. Okay, so those will separate out with my blue book. I try to keep everything like organized so I can get at the things when I want to decorate. Oh my gosh. So cute. Oh, and I love this. This is gorgeous. So cool. So I paid 10 cents for that. <laughs> love them. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, these are cool boxes. Halloween. Oh, luminaries. Ooh, those are very cool. I like these. Um, because we actually sit outside on Halloween and we light a fire in our driveway. So these will be cool to have out there um, while we wait for trick-or-treaters. Love that. My mother's best friend, her name was Birgit. I called her Aunt Birgit. And she loved strawberries. Maybe that's where I got my love for it. But something about this particular strawberry print really reminds me of her. So, Indian teepee kit. Oh, cool. It's a craft kit. Oh my gosh. No way. I don't have any paper dolls. Baby sister and me. Oh my gosh, this box alone. Oh my goodness, these are so cute. Holy cow. These are adorable. Look at all of these. Oh my gosh. So cute. Tons of clothes. And then ones that they made themselves. Oh, how sweet is that? I love these. Oh my gosh. These are so cute. I'm going to definitely um, stand the box up too. I love the box too. Holy cow, these are so cute. And I told you I'm getting that special tape to be able to repair old boxes. I have to order it from Amazon. So cute. Ooh, a spoon rest. This is cute. Very cute. Royal Season Stoneware. Nice, it's really big. Really nice. Ooh, I love this. This looks very, oh, it, I was gonna say it looks Swedish. Made in Sweden. I love this. Oh, this is so cute. Oh my goodness, I love it. And you put um, candles in here. Really pretty. That is so pretty. I love that. And you know I love all my Swedish decor. Since we live in Minnesota, there's a lot of um, Swedish and Norwegian um, heritage here. I love these things. My kids are going to think they're freaky. I always love them. And, oh my gosh, these are so cool. Very cool. They say, Buyer's Choice Limited. So cute. They're singing. Hello. So cute. What is this? Oh, he is cute. Oh no, it's broken. Poo. Well, I can repair them. It's just a bummer. Very sweet. Um, you know, I've been doing a lot of repairs because I keep breaking things. And my tight bond glue really works well. So I think I'll be able to repair him if I can find the other piece. Ooh, these are cool. These German, like, um, coasters. They're very cool. My son will think these are very cool. These are all old, like, bar coasters. Neat. Oh, these are so cool. All different ones. I'm definitely giving these to my son. He does not drink beer. Don't anyone be alarmed. But he likes to drink his drinks out of the big steins because he plays Dungeons and Dragons with his friends. And I don't know. They just think that's cool. So let me give those to him. Another cow caroler. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. This one is holding a Christmas goose. Cute is that? Adorable. You go with your friends. This box is chock full. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love these. Oh, I love these so much. I have one and it's orange, I think. 
I have one that looks like this, but now I have a whole bag of them. Oh my gosh, I love these so much. Thank you. Ooh, look at these old uh, clothes pins. Now, when I was at that vintage shop with, I think it was with Robin and Jamie, they had a jar of old clothes pins. They were like $36 for it or something crazy. Um, so you just stick these though in like an old mason jar or some kind of old cool jar that you like. And they just, they make a great display on a shelf. So cool, but I'm not going to pay $36. That's for sure. <gasps> oh my gosh. He's so silly and fun. Oh my gosh. I love him. He's going to go up with my, I have a donkey as well. Boy, these are cute. Why do I love these planters so much? This one's made in Japan. I love them though. I know the little animal planters are definitely one of my things. I have a lot of things. <laughs> things that I love. Uh-oh. This friend lost, lost an arm. Oh, he's a gardener. He's a gardener too. He's cute. I could definitely fix that. It's only one. It's only one. He's got his garden trowel. He's cute. I love garden themed things in the summer. Is this his wife? Oh my gosh, these are so funny. Ah! Why is she hiding it? Is she going to hit him with it? I don't know what's happening here. <laughs> Those are adorable. Holy cow. Feels like another one. Oh no. Oh my gosh, it's a set. Holy cow, these are so cute. I love these. I love these. Okay. These are awesome. I have a whole bag of wooden ornaments. Amazing. Oh, it's another one. Oh, they're, they're a thing. They're called bumpkins. These are so cute. I have, I do not, I've never seen these before, but they are stinking adorable. So cute. Bumpkins. Oh my gosh, they are so cute. This one, oh, she's walking a dog. Dog? Yes. Oh my gosh, I love these. These are so fun. It's adorable. Bumpkins. Now I need a shelf. I need a little shelf to put them on. Now I have a collection. Ooh, that's pretty. That's gorgeous. It's like luster glass. Very pretty. Is that like carnival glass? Really pretty. I love that. Hey! I was just, this is what I was talking about. My son loves these. So now he has a Christmas one with the Clydesdales on it. His name is Gabe. Cheers, Gabe. Oh, these are so cool. Hometown Holiday Budweiser Holiday Stein Collection. Oh my gosh, he's gonna really, really be happy about these. <laughs> oh, wait, I'm seeing a set here. Looks like... That is a mug, and this is its coaster. That is gorgeous. And you know, I bring out my orange lusterware in the fall to the stunner. That's real pretty. Like, is it, does it go like that? That's really pretty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Okay. And what is that? Ooh, is this a fancy mistletoe ball? Very pretty. Very pretty. And I think, oh, wait, nope, just kidding. There's one more thing. Almost missed it. Ooh, these are cute. Ooh, now, okay. My friend Tammy Roberts. So these are shower hooks, Christmas ones. But my friend Tammy uses these as napkin rings. So I'm going to have to look at her video again to see how she did it exactly. But that would be really pretty, huh? A napkin ring really pretty all right and I think I think that's it oh my gosh this is adorable <laughs> she makes me smile she's gonna have to go on my desk I think all right I think that's it thank you so much for all of these great presents and thank you so much for hanging out with me while I open them I like to do these casual videos sometimes. I hope you're all having a lovely Friday night. I hope it's warmer where you are than where I am, although we are getting a little bit warmer weather this weekend, which I'm very thankful for. So um, I hope you enjoy this video, and until my next one, take care of yourselves. Good night.